Hi, my name is Winslet, and welcome to this week's video on Age of Wonders Planetfall. Unlike the past few weeks, we're not going to be talking about any mechanics in-game or actually having a guest. Last week we talked a little bit about the first teaser for the third and final expansion for Age of Wonders Planetfall with Mr. No, but I figured that it would be best to put out this video deciphering the second teaser as soon as possible because I think we're going to get a full trailer tomorrow which actually tells us the release date and the reason I think that is because the last teaser I'm pretty sure gave us the date October 13th today is October 12th so this video came um, a day earlier than I was expecting and I think it tells us that the release date is November 10th. I'll get more into why I think about that later in the video. I think we should probably start off with actually watching the teaser and then I can break down how I got to November 10th. So yeah, let's play this. I would full screen it, but it would uh, make recording this a little bit trickier. So selected something. We got these constellations on the outside. That wasn't in the last video. It goes through quite a few numbers, more than last time. Last time we only had, I think, five numbers. So yeah, this is going by really, really quickly. I don't expect you to know what it's saying at this point in time. Um, yeah, that sequence is... Well, we took pictures of it and we put it in Discord here, which we were able to decipher. It gives us, on the outside, some letters. Those constellation makes letters. We have S, S, I, A, V, N, O, G, K, R, T, T, E, N, N, and um, underneath it there are some numbers and letters which we used in the last video to figure out the October 13th date. I actually think that there may be some use for those numbers and letters in this, um, this puzzle, but people were able to figure out based on a leak what the name of the expansion pack is and then with that they're able to unjumble these words enough to get uh, the name of the expansion which is Star Kings that's something that people are talking about all over um, discord and the forms and uh, if you yeah if you take out those letters from the the sequence we have on the left side of this image you're left with NOV T E N. Of course, you got to jumble that to get the right um, order, and that's November 10th, which makes sense based on what we were thinking that there would be a month in between the teaser and the actual release date, and um, that's basically a month from today. It's a it's a little bit sooner. It's a couple days sooner, but it's pretty much the same thing. So this this has to be the release date. Um, for multiple reasons, not just that. It's also a Tuesday. They, the people over at um, Triumph and Paradox Interactive love releasing their games and their expansion packs on Tuesdays, so this is making sense on so many levels that that would be our final answer. Um, what else are people saying? Yeah, they. some people think that those numbers were at the bottom were a bit of a red herring to kind of throw us off and that the real answer this time was just the constellations on the on the outside. I should give credit to um, Orange Lex for piecing this all together. We play multiplayer with them on Saturday, so that's really cool. Somebody from the community was able to do that first. Um, and then Joyce, she helped out a whole lot with like putting this image together. I believe that was her. Um, and then, yeah, somebody else, Blitzcloud, was saying that he, they think that these numbers and letters tell us where the corresponding um, letter above should go. And they basically were saying that um, the first character S gives us hex 5, that's S and 5 here, and that the triangles in the center gave them 
zero one uh, zero one, which is five, and because it was rotating counterclockwise uh, when it, it went to the first letter, um, that was subtracting five from that uh, that hex number that we get. The five that's right here, basically we're taking five from here and subtracting it from um, this five right here to tell us where that S would go. And then the next one after that was another S. It was hex four. That's the uh, thing right here. That's what that number is trying to, or those symbols represent as a four. And if you want to understand why I went over that in the last teaser video, they, they reused the um, part of the puzzle. And because it went clockwise to get to the four um, and the, this S, it, you add them together to get eight, which is the eighth position. So zero position for the first S, that's zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's where the other S goes. Makes sense to me. There's a couple ends in here, so I wasn't quite able to figure out where those were supposed to go because this the whole triangle nonsense, converting that to binary makes absolutely no sense to me. And uh, if you understand what's going on here and you think you could explain it to me and my community, I would love a comment about that. Or if that you think it's yeah, just like a red herring, I'd love to hear your thoughts on that because I feel like there's something here, but I could be wrong. It seems like most people in the community think that this is just like useless info. Um, but yeah, basically you could go through all these letters, get a position for them, and then rearrange them to give you Star Kings November 10. It just makes sense to me. And um, yeah, there's also some cool uh, information about the expansion already out there because of the sleek. If you want to go check that out, I believe people are talking about it on the forums and Discord, so you can go check them out there. Um, thanks for joining me here. I, I really enjoyed piecing this all together with the Discord community. I felt like I contributed a little bit more this time. Um, so yeah, see you around. Have a good one.